free Palestine, free Palestine. And, peace and peace for all. For all. And, I and I repeat, free Palestine, free Palestine. and vote, and vote yes, yes for the resolution. Yes, 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 yes. That's, what that's what you're what doing, you're shredding, shredding the UN, the UN Charter. Charter. Shame on you. I have stood hundreds of times before at this podium, but never for a more significant vote than the one about to take place, a historic one. A yes vote is a vote for Palestinian existence. It is not against any state but it is against the attempts to deprive us of our state. That is why the Israeli government is so opposed to it, because they oppose our independence and the two-state solution altogether. With this new precedent, we may see here representatives of ISIS or Boko Haram that will sit among us. You know what? This will be fitting for the new moral standard being set here today, giving the rights of a state to an entity that is already partially controlled by terrorists and will be replaced by a force of child-murdering Hamas rapists. Unbelievable. Truly unbelievable. With today's vote, you are not only bypassing the Security Council in violation of the Charter, but you are bastardizing the meaning of peace-loving. You know that the Palestinians are the exact opposite of peace-loving. You know this. Since they rejected the UN partition plan in 1947, they rejected it. They have only tried to destroy Israel time and again. They are terror loving, not peace loving. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Don't forget to like our videos and hit the bell icon to stay updated with the latest.